Take it slow. Please respond.
here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and ancestor of yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously. I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you. Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay. Okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know? How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? But it's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamata... No one believes Yamata is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamata. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. You don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place has a bad energy. Bad storms, more like, makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. The stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously Enough. cons- Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? Remember Roth's training. You can have the best form and technique in the world, but it won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. So hungry. I need to find something to eat.
sorry. Don't you always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. If you can learn to read the land and the stars, you'll always be able to find your way home. This is Conrad Roth, captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Roth! Lara! You're alive! Easy, easy. Are you okay? What happened? I remember the beach, and then it went black, and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Roth, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. <sighs> Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay. Music. Hello? Hello? Is someone there? Oh God, this is 
insane. This traditional no mask represents a hateful woman in the guise of a demon. There are traces of white paint on the inside. Whoever used this mask was of noble birth. Get that? Got it. We have a fire. Look for the smoke. We're on our way. Laura, you made it. Sam. Um, Thank goodness. Surprise. It's okay. He's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the sun. Right, Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <laughs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to myths. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds of the battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. <sighs> but what happened to her?
We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Rock? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Laura and meet up with Rock. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no. Le uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's it's been a while. It, it's all coming back to me. Get to Rock. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. You gonna be okay? Yes, I. Oh, we just need to rest for a few minutes. You sit. Uh, you sit here. I'll. Uh, <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay. These are fascinating. I've seen these before. Oh. They must be ritualistic. This, this female image is particularly interesting. Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. <laughs> Remarkable. Yes, well, let's hope we don't become murderers, too. See if you can work the other one. Together. Oh, shit. 
Shit. It won't take the fourth. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Incredible. Need a bit more. Amaterasu? Possibly. Possibly. Why was this a fire? How do I start? Okay. This is Lara Croft. An archaeologist from the Endurance, shipwrecked on an island in the Dragon's Triangle, east of Japan. This place is incredible. I've seen wrecks here that could date back centuries. We weren't the first, and I know we're not alone. Something isn't right about this place. If I don't get off this island, maybe someone will eventually find this. Find more. Another shrine. Who are they worshipping? Should do it. Let's see if I can fix this up. Right, that should do it.
were actually on an expedition to find the homeland of my ancestors. And ever since I told Lara the story of Himiko years ago, she's been hunting for its location. I never really gave it much thought that any of this could actually be real history. My grandmother used to tell me the story like it was a memory. Many thousands of years ago, Queen Himiko ruled the land of Yamatai. The sun rose at Himiko's command and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. But one day, Yamatai simply disappeared without a trace, forgotten in time. The Sun Queen. Himiko, are you sure you're not channeling Sam, Dr. Whitman? Well, there's no doubt. Himiko had power. Some say shamanistic, elemental. A woman wields that much power, and sooner or later it gets called witchcraft. We shouldn't discount anything, even what may seem to us irrational. We still have much to learn about the world. You sound like my father. It could be one hell of a story, Laura. Not if we don't live to tell it. Incredible. It is Himiko. But look, the bowl, the candles. Why is she still being worshipped? This island, it must have once been part of Yamatai. You were right, Laura. <gasps> the Lost Kingdom. It's like finding Atlantis. But this is real, Dr. Whitman. We're not standing on a myth. No, <laughs> we're standing on a gold mine. Come, quickly. Your friends are hurt. Yes, probably by them. Get back. They can't be trusted. <gasps> you still have a gun. I don't want any trouble. No. We'll come. But I insist that afterwards you take us to whoever's in charge. What are you doing? Be quiet. No! I'm handling this! No! No! Oh! no! Please! Get off! Oh! Just, just go along with them, Laura. Do, do whatever they say. Dye me your pistolet. Iti. Who are you people? What do you with us? Laura! If they give you any trouble, kill them! Don't hurt them, please! Silence, girl. But if yet, Haroshinka, yeah, then, Nakumina Yashmayu Siestri. Let go! Let go! Laura, run! Oh, no! No! Run them up! Run them up! Don't you fucking move! Kill them all! Don't hey, make bring up the prisoner! Yeah, I'm on it!
Anything? I can't find it. Oh, God. Keep looking. There. Another one. Oh, God. All right. This group's got some fight. Move out. We're gonna have to kill us. Too bad. We're gonna use some more groups. Hey! The girl is missing. Keep an eye out. All right. Ты играть в прятки, малышка. Думаешь, удастся спасти? No one escapes. Out. Вылезай! Но трать моего времени! I always fight. <laughs> Вылезай! Но трать моего времени! Она тоже была порадочной стерва! Боже, была порадочной стерлой. Probably 
Another tanker? Nah. Look like some kind of research ship. Should be some good stuff then. Oh, why not soon? We got a crew towing it in now. Think we'll get any new recruits out of this bunch? Ah, man, I don't know. Better for them if they just die now. How'd you think? What? What's going on down there? Everything okay? Are you there? Yes. I can see smoke coming from the old ruins. Are you okay? Oh God, Roth, I'm in trouble. They're killing people. What? Who? Men. I don't know why. I had to kill some of them. I had no choice. That can't have been easy. It's scary just how easy it was. You've got to warn the others, Roth. Don't worry about them right now. You just do whatever it takes to get to me, Lara. I'll try. Smaller group escaped into the lower forest. Maybe we get a hunting party down there. No, Father Matthias went himself. Told us to stay out. What? Why? I don't know. Maybe another girl for the ritual. <sighs> we'll know more by tonight. There was a bloodbath down there. Vladimir's in charge. What'd you expect? He loves killing. What's Father Matthias have to say about that? Not a damn thing. The Russians have been with him forever. He trusts them. So that means they can break the rules? They make the rules, brother. Just follow along. Keep your head down. I'm gonna check things out below.
here somewhere. Find her. <laughs> what was that? Quiet, quiet! You two, check that side. Got it. She's got to be here somewhere! Did you find anything on that side? Oh! Not a damn thing! Whoa. Hey, watch it! How far down does it go? All the way to the sea gate. Damn. Maybe she fell. No. I don't think so. Worse than it is. Uh, Have you heard from any of the others? Nothing. Wait, what are you doing? The wolves took my food pack. The transmitter from the lifeboat's in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. Yeah, you need you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. And also in the pack. Shit. Exactly. Come here. Don't do this to me, you northern bastard.
up there somewhere. Young lady like you learned to do a thing like that. <laughs> Late shift at the nine bells. <laughs> Wolf's got nothing on a broken bottle. Hey, you got it. Nice work. So I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower. Well, that should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction. Send out that SOS. 
And I'm not climbing anytime soon. Yeah, I was afraid you were going to say that. You can do it, Laura. After all, you're a croft. I don't think I'm that kind of croft. Sure you are. You just don't know it yet. Well, that's type of my fast letter then. Just be careful, Laura. <laughs>